Hey, what's going on guys? Josh here for Classic Elite, and this is the video review for The Simpsons Arcade that was recently released on the Xbox Live Arcade and PlayStation Network. Now, before I dig into all the great goodness here and go save Maggie, I have to mention that all of the beautiful 720p gameplay footage from this review was recorded using the Hapag Colossus HD capture card. Alright guys, I'm just going to lay it out here and tell you, I really like this game um, for multiple reasons. One, I'm a really big Simpsons fan, and two, I'm a big fan of a genre that is no longer around, and that is the classic coin-sucking arcade beat-em-up, and that is what the Simpsons arcade is. The original game came out back in 1991 when the Simpsons reigned supreme. You couldn't go five feet without hearing Eat My Shorts or I Carumba. There were Simpsons merchandise everywhere, and it was a great time to be a kid. It was really, really, really awesome. The fact of the matter is, though, when the market gets saturated so heavily with merchandise, uh, a lot of it isn't that good. Uh, the Simpsons have had several, and I mean several, really bad video games. But the Simpsons Arcade is a real exception to that rule. It's a quality arcade game that stood toe-to-toe -to -toe in the arcades with its beat-em-up brethren like Streets of Rage and the X-Men Arcade game. And in comparing it to those, uh, you guys can pretty much tell where I'm going to go with the uh, description of the gameplay. Arcade beat-em-up, you run left to right through eight levels until you eventually beat the game. You can play as four different Simpsons characters, and that is the core cast of the series. That is Homer, Marge, Bart, and Lisa. They all control a little differently, but it's ultimately the same experience. You're going to run, uh, you're going to jump, and you're going to attack. So there are two buttons and a joystick, and that is all you're going to use. There is a little variety in what you're doing in the fact that you can do a special jump attack and when you're playing with other players, you can team up with one other person and do a combo attack that does a little more damage. That's it. That is really all there is to it. Well, maybe not everything. There are also uh, items you can use in the environment to attack other enemies like slingshots and signposts and mailboxes. And there are food items hidden throughout the level to give you a little extra life. And when I say little, I mean a little bit. Because, like I said, this game was designed to suck quarters. It was just it's just what every game did back in that era. If it's in an arcade, it's in there to make money. So what they did was they threw enemy after enemy after enemy at you, cheap hits, you name it, anything to try to make you die and put more quarters into the machine. If you saw someone who was on stage 8 fighting the final boss of this game, you knew they easily spent $10. <laughs> Maybe $5 if they were a really, really good Simpsons arcade player. So I'm mentioning the fact that the game is nostalgic, it's old, it's retro, it came from a different era. So the gameplay is repetitive, the game is short. But that's okay, I do not fault it for that whatsoever at all, because this is just a straight up port. There are a few unlockables, there are trophies and achievements to get, so within let's say three hours you could pretty much do everything the game has to offer. But you're only going to spend $10 or 800 Microsoft Space Points to experience all The Simpsons has to offer. And really, that's a steal considering, what did I say? Like $20 to beat this game in the arcade by yourself? So guys, if you're a Simpsons fan, if you're a fan of those classic arcade beat-em-ups, or if you're a fan of both, fantastic. <laughs> Go have at it. This game is great. It's aged pretty well. It looks pretty good considering the fact that it came out back in 1991. So for $10, you could really do a lot worse. And if you have three friends, I say, I caramba. Go pick up the Simpsons Arcade today.